Look at what they've got. Capture. That's fine. Capture. Over there. This is police brutality in yeah. Melbourne, mate. That's uncalled for. He's a security guard working on the job. Did you do that to Channel 9? Did you do that to Channel 7? Did you do that to SBS and ABC? Did you? My members are trying to do it. And he's not an offender. He's not an offender. He's my security guard. He's my security guard. So we're here now, two and a half hours after the event started. The event went peacefully um, until the organisers started to disperse. When police were um, outnumbered, probably 100 to 1, they backed down. Suddenly there is a small group left and police are taking them down violently. Grab this no, 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 he's security. Hey, he's our security, sir. He's our security. I'm at work. He's our security. He's our security. He's our security. What? He's our security. That's our. He's working with us. He's working with us. He's working with us. You've arrested our security. You've arrested our security. We're not going to tolerate that. We're not going to tolerate that. That's our guy. Come around here. Come around the side. No, you've taken our security. You've taken our security. So, come, come back. They've taken our security, and we need, we're here. We need to wait for our security. Just go around here. Around here. So they've just arrested our security, violently arrested our security on the job. They haven't done that to Channel 9, Channel 7, Channel 10, SBS, ABC, who are all here with security. Our security guard, they violently tackled. Can I talk to you who's in charge? Look at him. They've got Daniel on the ground, who is here as our licensed security guard, who came here, licensed, working. And, and I told you guys at the time that he was working security. Look at what they've got. Capture it. That's fine. This is police brutality in Melbourne, mate. That's uncalled for. He's a security guard working on the job. Did you do that to Channel 9? Did you do that to Channel 7? Did you do that to SBS and ABC? Did you? My members are trying to do it. And he's not an offender. He's not an offender. He's my security guard. He's my security guard. So you realise they arrested my security guard. Are you okay with that? I've, I've made it clear and he made it clear he was on the job and you've arrested him while doing his job. You didn't do that to Channel 9, 7 and 10. Yeah. I've made it clear that's the one that was in charge. So if when this goes to court, it's going to be clear. They've been told numerous times that he's on the job. Look at that. Treating him like a criminal. Not here to protest. Oh, here we go. The lawyer's on the line. Hi, Madeline. So they've... They violently have arrested my security, who made it clear he was security. Um, what should I do? They've got him. Can the lawyer talk to someone? Who can the lawyer to? His, his lawyer's on the phone here. up there. What, what, what can we do? Nothing. We've got to wait. So I call from the police. Where they take him, the lawyer wants to know. Harvey's starting to become a bit more problematic, so we might need to look at what Harvey's role is here in the moment. If you're starting to cause breaches of the peace, you'll be in trouble. So um, I'm, I'm here because my you've taken no, my security we'll, guard. We'll go over there with him and have a chat. Uh, can you I go know, in there? Can you take me there? You can stay on the outside, but you can't, I don't see any need for you to be here if you want to protect him. So no, see you later. What, what are you talking about? You've what taken you my security go? guard. Go over there with him. Am I allowed to go there? And you can stay around the outside of the area. I don't understand what you're saying. What you, my lawyer's here. You want to talk to her? Here. Oh, so What's your right. name? Jamie Templeton. Okay. Inspector Jamie Templeton is... I don't know. Where do I go? Can I go to my security guard that you've arrested unlawfully? If he starts breaching, if he starts the road, he breaches at the moment, in addition to my efforts. I'm breaching the CHO directives now. I'm, I'm, I'm working. I'm, where, I'm, I'm on camera with... Okay, do you want to have this argument again? You don't know the law. Right, move on, thanks. Please move back behind the court and you're right We're there? Here. That's, That's right. right, thank, thank you. you. Yeah. He does. He told me to go right here. You get squashed by a horseman. He, that it, okay. Well, that escalated quickly as soon as they uh, suddenly felt empowered um, to do it. But we're going to fight for our, our security guard. And uh, right now we have seven cases in front of the Supreme Court for seven different matters. And uh, it looks like we're going to add another one.
It's come over North East Mile I've come over to try to find I, I get it. I'm, I'm, I'm annoyed because your inspector there is acting like, and, and they've targeted him. I because, mate. I'm not going to comment uh, on what he did. So, yeah, all I want is him. So, once he's I'll free, come back with yeah. you and answer with whatever Thank you, you want, okay? Yep. Cheers, thanks, mate. As you saw there, they didn't target me because I guess how many times can you make the same mistake? The inspector tried to intimidate me after the fact, but again, back down um, because uh, I think he was unsure of himself. But they took down our security. Our security who, by the way, every news crew here had security. None of them were pinned to the ground and, and dragged off to the police station. I just had word that he's been taken away to uh, Melbourne West Police Station. We're going to go there and we're going to break him free. We're going to use the lawyer to make sure to, to ensure that we get him out. And we're going to fight any charges. With your help, guys, fightthefines.com.au. That's how we're going to pay for his defence. That's how we're going to fight them. So we're here at Melbourne West Police Station where our security guard is being... Oh, here we go. <laughs> he was being processed. The, the lawyers have been on the case talking to the sergeant. They told us he was coming out any minute. He's come out before I even got to m do my piece to camera. Daniel, how are you doing? Yeah, yeah, I'm all right. So yeah, they... They, they targeted you today. Yes. I was very clear with the arresting officers that I was at work, uh, who I am, what I'm doing. I mean, I had the high-vis vest on. With the big there. security at the yeah, back. Yeah, and uh, I mean, I think it was would be pretty obvious from an outsider's point of view that I'm holding you guys, I'm making sure you guys are safe. It's your um, job. Yeah. You're licensed. It's a job. We're paying you to be here. We're yeah. paying the company that Which... employs you to be here. Yes. You're insured. You're doing everything by the rules. Yes. They targeted you. Correct. And, like, I, I mean, I tried telling him that during the melee, and he just said, no, don't, don't care. Get him. Go. And I'm like, I'm working. No. Uh, very confrontational. Um, look, I was punched a few times. Uh, definitely need. Uh, I'll tell you, I mean, it doesn't look as bad now. Oh, it's um, red. Can you see that? I'm telling Come you. Come in here. Like, they were very, very tight. And to me, it, it felt very malicious and vindictive. You've got a fine and I don't know if there are any charge, anything that comes of this, um, we are 100%, but obviously we're paying your bill for today, including all the hours you spent in arrest and people at home can ho help us fund that bill at supportrv.com because without you, as we saw, I'm in trouble. I can't be at some of these things alone, or, or anything. People, there are people that don't like me. Imagine yeah. that. So yeah. I need you there, but so you know you're not alone. Uh, people are actually going to donate to help us cover all the legal costs associated with um, fighting back fighting and what, fighting the fine and any charges and potentially even taking them to court on this because um, we have a matter in the Supreme Court where we've added a few things but I don't think I can add your case on that yep. so we may have to create Supreme. a new account for you. How do you feel about that? You happy with that? Yeah, I'd be very happy with that because to me, like I said, it felt targeted. It, uh, it was pretty obvious who I am, who you are, what we're doing. It felt malicious and vindictive. Let me ask you one more important question because right, your, your legal fees are covered and whatever we got to do, we're going to do it and the Rebel News is behind you and the, the viewers are behind you. But for me, most important, are you willing to come back next time? Absolutely. Like, I've got a job to do. It's uh, being arrested. I mean, it's a little sore, but I've got a job to do. That that doesn't worry me. Thank you, brother. You always got my back. I appreciate it. And uh, we'll have your back now. Thank you. Fightthefines.com.au to help us with the legal fees and support RV.com to help us cover his fees. Avi Mini in Melbourne, Australia, for Rebel News, never backing down, no matter who they pick on.